All right, guys, welcome back to the progress update. We're gonna take you through everything today, what's been happening so far. So quick off today, I brought the headlights in. We're just gonna check if they work. Everything is uh, working nicely and make sure everything's operating well before, just in case uh, I have to buy another set. <laughs> and I don't wanna do that. So we're gonna test them out and we'll show you some parts we got already. So we managed to get the airbox headlight bracket in second hand from another, from another vehicle. So they're busy aligning everything up now. They're putting the cradle, everything back in together. We managed to get another grill because the one on here was damaged. A new tail light, the two control arms and the cooler I bought brand new from Land Rover. Um, the second end pricing on them was a bit off, so a little bit more when you get a brand new thing, you know everything's working on Kidori. And some little plastic trims and stuff. There's some more stuff that's locked up in the in the warehouse, but for the most part we've pretty much got everything. So here's the new bonnet that we received. So they're busy just fitting and aligning. As you can see there's no damage whatsoever to the bonnet, which was nice. I think it just had a little scratch mark on the top here. Can't even see it. It was somewhere on the top here. Small little mark, but other than that, the thing is pretty much perfect, which is nice. So we're starting up with the alignment and the car's coming out well, fixing everything. So the new door is up. I managed to get a nice spotless door. As you can see in there, they'll just remove this beading because this comes with a normal F pace, but the doors are the same. So get that on spray painted, but the rear quarter panel has been fixed up now. So it had a little dent here, which is, you know, there's no point in removing, uh, replacing the whole skin for a small dent like that. So they pulled that out and it's already primed so they'll finish that up and get everything ready to go. So soon we'll be starting with paint. I think in the next day or two, they'll start painting this thing up and uh, we'll see the finished product very soon. So I managed to get the airbag set as well as you'll see, in, I think in the previous video we've, we've done. Airbag set is, Already, yeah, but I, yeah, they'll probably leave that for last. Yeah, see, it's not installed yet, but that's that's quick to install. That'll be one, two, three, and we're ready to go. So we'll leave that for last. But yeah, pretty much all the all the things are done. So the rest I need to get is just small nitty stuff. So I've ordered a new fender, the new arch that goes on there, some of the bumper spoilers and the grills. You know, those small things to get second hand. It's just, it can be really tough, especially if you're running around driving everywhere for 500 rand items. You might as well just go to to Lavin, well, to the agents and go buy them. But they are pretty pretty penny, so it is what it is. And I managed to get this cover for the opposite side as well. I got that from Land Rover directly. It was actually pretty cheap. And yeah, so that's basically it. So we can start testing the headlights. Let's plug these bad boys in, yeah. Okay. Can you just hold this for me? Just want to make sure these things are working. And then you'll need to hold the other side. Just smile, I eh? don't worry, the camera won't bite. <laughs> just hold this for me there. As you'll see, our two headlight brackets are standing here. <laughs> Let me disconnect this thing to the battery quickly. Hey, something, did something come on there? Was it flashing? Okay, let's just see. Okay, there we go, there we go. We got some life here. Indicators are working. Make sure this thing turns on. All right, so I'm pretty much happy with everything. The lights are working. Thank God for that. <laughs> That's all grafting them well, I see it wanted to start, but this battery is a bit too flat to get this thing started, but soon we'll do that once everything's completed. Let me relieve my headlight brackets here. Okay, lekker. So we confirmed the headlights are working, which is great. So. They can be used that for aligning now, especially when aligning all the panels together, your headlights are very important to have them in place. So I think uh, we'll give them a few days to start finishing everything up. I think by 
What's today? Monday. By Thursday, there should be lack of progress on here. Basically, almost done. I think they'll start painting by today or tomorrow. Getting all the panels painted and even including the bonnet and everything. Get everything lined up nicely. So, we'll come do again a nice little progress video by Thursday. And everything should basically almost be done. We're just waiting for the prop shaft to come in because we redid the CV. That's why the wheels and everything are not on yet. Uh, on the left front. Once that's in, everything's grafting lacquer, then we can start driving the thing around and moving it everywhere and uh, get this thing ready to go. But yeah, I'm excited. It's going to be lacquer. It's almost done. It's just sitting in the car there. It was quite nice. Eh? I almost felt like I wanted to just drive off the lot here. Yeah. But it's almost there. Almost there. Basically, all the small things are almost done and then we'll get everything reassembled. As I mentioned previously, the radiator set was all untouched, so that will put last once we're ready to assemble everything. But it's almost ready to go, so I'm happy. I'm happy where like, everything's looking right now. So I think I'm just going to go to Land Rover now, order the, the rest of the small bits and bobs because sometimes they take a few days to come in. So let's get that ordered and while it's on the way they can finish everything up and then when they arrive it's all small things we can put on afterwards. It's all cosmetic stuff, it's like, like I said, the, the wheel arch, the little spoiler that you put on everything when, once it's done. So we'll go order that so long now and then by the time they're ready to, to paint then we'll be good to go. So happy days. I'm very excited, it's coming out nicely. As I mentioned, I've already got the windscreen, so that will be done once everything is finished. Slying one side there in the, in the warehouse, just to make sure it doesn't get damaged or anything. So, uh, usually I like to buy that last, but I got one at a good price. So I was like, let me just take it now and keep it safe before I need it and it's sold, then it's a headache. But for the most part, everything looks good. I'm happy with everything's looking here right now. His bonnet. Yeah, let me show you the old bonnets. He's still, like I mentioned, he's still going to fix it for us anyway. But uh, this is pretty much what it was looking like. So we'll see what it looks like when he's finished. I mean, I, like I said, I, mean, I was going to replace the bonnet regardless because it's a frontal piece and I want to make sure everything is nice. And especially when the car comes out, I want it to look pretty much perfect. But it's coming along nicely. Worst case scenario, if you couldn't find a bonnet, this would work, but. We'll see how it comes out when he's done and we'll, we'll, we'll test it and see if it came out lacquer. But anyways, thanks again for joining guys. It was quite fun to see the car here and I haven't been here for the past week. So I like to see the progress was what's going on here. So it's moving along nicely. So I'd say maybe another week or two car should be done and then we'll be ready to rip the streets brother rip the streets let's go thanks for watching guys please subscribe share the channel and uh, thanks again have a lucky one ciao ciao